welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is naomi amber and if you're new what's good what's popping it's lit around here if you didn't already know so just go ahead and make sure i hit that subscribe button so that way you don't miss any of my content okay trust me you're in for a treat today we have a huge sheen haul i have so many items to show you guys i have so many outfit inspo ideas to show you guys let me show y'all oh, oh goodness gracious this is mad heavy I have this big old, I have this big old box full of Shein stuff, jackets, sweaters, boots, accessories. Y'all, I already got y'all. So before we get into it, I do want to thank our partners for today's video, Dossier. Shout out to them for partnering with me for this video. And I think that these scents would really go well with a lot of the outfits that I'm going to show you guys later. So let's get into them. So here is the first scent. We just have floral berries. Top notes we have peony red apple berries middle notes rose carnations and jasmine and then base notes suede accord and musk and this one is inspired by joe malone peony and blush suede cologne here is miss a floral berry since it's the holidays i know that berries is kind of like a you know out there kind of scent maybe something more for the spring like floral berries but in my head i was thinking you know like cranberry is a very popular like topping to put on a lot of things during the holidays like on your turkey or like you know cranberry muffins i don't know but <laughs> all i know is that this smells mad good and this one is really gonna rock the pants off of your family and friends during this holiday season so don't be shy don't miss out go ahead run don't walk to the dossier website i know you guys need some holiday gift inspiration so take my word for it and take my recommendation and okay and for this next one we have oriental vetiver so top notes are bergamot lemon and bushu middle notes orange blossom marigold and violet and base notes vetiver amber and cedarwood and this one is inspired by the byredo bal de afrique or du parfum i don't know if you guys are familiar with um the bal de afrique or the byredo i don't know if i'm pronouncing that right their fragrances but their fragrances are i think around 200 dollars and up so this is definitely a still of a deal and that's why i love dossier they give you luxury fragrances at a fair price like imagine spending that 200 plus dollars on bal de afrique when you can literally get the same quality with dossier like Mm. If you know anyone that likes anything like really clean and really floral, those are great gifts to give them because they have that clean and floral feeling and I love it. Like I said, run, do not walk to the Dossier website. They have free returns and exchanges forever. They have a risk-free system. So if you don't like the scent, you can send it back and you can get a replacement. So that is amazing. They also have a welcome offer of 20% off your first order and you can also combine it with my promo code 10 Naomi, so you can get a total up to 30% off your first order. Order. so how's that for a steal of a deal like if you guys didn't know dossier donates all the return perfume bottles to a charity organization and they're trying to stay away from using plastic by giving up the two milliliter samples but like i said before our orders are risk-free and returnable if you don't absolutely love it which i'm sure you will um you're able to return it and above all all the perfumes are vegan cruelty free with clean ingredients and never tested on animals and along with smelling your best you also gotta look your best so let's get into these fits first things first i just have this top this skims-esque top it's in like this sage green color i'm sure if you've seen any other shein hauls you guys have definitely seen this top before you guys are not foreign to this top okay i do not have any skims loungewear i do have like fendi skims like undergarments but nevertheless i do not have any skims anything but i feel like if anything this is very similar it does get very luxury and quality i think i got an extra small i don't know what possessed me to get an extra small i definitely could have gotten like a medium but i did want it to fit super tight literally cuts right above my belly button it does give that baby tee effect like in the 90s so i don't know i don't hate it i'm not mad at it i feel like i can still make it work and i can also just lounge around in this like i don't really care also i got the top in this gray color yeah so same vibe literally just in a different color but i did get two of them um i do feel like i do want to go back and get like the matching shorts they do have like a matching short kind of thing going on too so i might go ahead and go back and get the shorts but it's winter time so i'm not really too pressed if they still have it when spring roll around then i'm gonna get it 
but like I usually say, summer bodies are made in the winter and I love Shein's workout sets. Most of their workout stuff does come in a set so you don't have to buy like separate tops and bottoms which I love. So I just got this gray set. The leggings do look a little short. I don't know if you guys know, but I'm about like five, six, five, seven. So the leggings are a little short, they're a little high on me, but you guys will see them in the try on portion. And they're very thick, like super thick. And then here is the top. It's just this long sleeve, like this does not look like it's gonna fit me. Maybe it'll stretch, who knows, we'll see. Moving on to the next thing I got is just this long sleeve maxi, super maxi dress. I don't think it has any slits in it, but I do think this is a very nice um, piece to put like under a jacket, a nice long trench coat. It ain't the warmest thing, it ain't the warmest thing. I will tell you that, it's not the warmest thing. The material is not the thickest, but I do think this is a great piece to put under things if you wanna start layering. It's so, it's super long. Like I said, I'm a pretty tall girl, so if you are shorter than me, <laughs> like if you're like 5'2", you're gonna be drowning in this. Like the dress is going to be dragging. And I definitely got this, I got this in an extra small, so it's super long for reference, but I got it in brown. Also got it in black. So I am excited to wear these, but I do feel like there's also opportunity for you to dress it up and make it a little bit more fun, a little bit more classy, but it's definitely very casual nice vibe hopefully it's not too see-through but you guys will see that in the try on portion okay so the next thing that i got i feel like goes i feel like every time i'm on pinterest i see this item and i don't have it and i feel like i need it if i want to complete certain outfits okay so here is the dress it is just black and it has like this turtleneck um little action going on at the top it is ribbed and it is sleeveless and it is also mini but don't be alarmed don't be alarmed because i plan to pair this with like with a leather trench coat and some boots that i also want to show you guys later that i got from shein i could pair it with a regular leather jacket and i also want to pair with some sheer black tights and some black boots and see how that goes i just Either way, I feel like it's going to be a vibe. Like, I'm not really worried about it being a vibe or not because I know it is. And that's why I got it because I know it's a staple. Like, every time I'm on Pinterest, I see this dress. I'm like, let me just go ahead and get the dress. So that way, I don't have to worry about not having it in my closet. And now you won't have to worry if you go ahead and purchase it. So the next and final dress that I have is just this. Well, it was supposed to be brown. And it's showing up like this green color on camera um i really wanted the white one and i'm a little sad that i got this one because it's like it's really not translating into like what i was really expecting it to be um but yeah it's just this um greenish looking sweater it does have an open back it is giving like a bit of see-throughness so i don't know we'll see how it how it vibes out in the try on portion. Yeah, like this material is very thin. Like the sweater material is very thin. So hopefully it looks good on. Nevertheless, I'm here for an open back moment. I love open back moment. So we'll see how this goes. A few of my Shein hauls before I did get a brown, like oversized sweater. Um, but this time I decided to go ahead and get the same sweater in black. I really love the quality of these sweaters. They're so soft on the inside. They're like the right amount of oversized and they fit really, really well. Like this is a great quality item if you want like simple basics, um, simple affordable basics from Shein. This is like the way to go. I got the brown one, so now I got the black one. Okay, now moving on to coats. This is the show stop okay this is what y'all came here for this is what y'all came here for this is the jacket this is the jacket y'all came here for let me just jump the gun a little bit i was gonna go in order but i'm not the jacket it is this black um fur trimmed jacket i feel like zara has a very similar jacket for like a a really pretty penny for a really expensive price but i have the same jacket and i think i got it for like Maybe like $30 or something. I don't know. It's so warm. So warm. And I have so many outfit ideas. I'm going to insert them on the screen. But you guys will also see it in the try on portion. Even though I'm trying it on right now. Um, 
I'll insert all my outfit inspirations for this. You can wear it with that black dress I just showed you guys. You can wear it with some green pants. You can wear it with a black jumpsuit underneath. Like the opportunities with this jacket are endless. Like this jacket is never coming out of my winter rotation. Never. Okay. And then a match with the jacket. I did get this a bag off of Shein. Um, this little like emblem here reminds me of Fendi. Um, but it's not Fendi and it didn't cost no Fendi price but there is straps now there's one strap it comes with like the fur um like shirling trim and then there's another strap that is long and just black but I'm rocking with the, the the mini the mini strap I'm rocking with the mini strap I feel like I look so expensive like but I did not break the bank I love that I really really love this it gives luxe the fur is not looking cheap at all it just it's like such a winter staple I love this jacket so much like you don't even know so the next thing that I got is just another puffer coat I do not have a brown puffer coat in my I don't know if you guys want me to do like a jacket haul or something or like how I style my puffer coats um but here is I mean it's not really too many ways to style them but here is the coat um, it is super puffy, which I absolutely love. Like sometimes puffer jackets cannot have as much puff and it can make it look a little bit cheap. But no, this has the right amount of puff. And I would wear this with like a cream like jumpsuit and like my easy foam runners. Ooh, that'd be such a vibe. And yeah, I am messing with this. It is, I wish it was more of like a deeper brown. It's more of like a, like a caramel brown and it doesn't have pockets, which is like kind of a bummer. Like, I thought I had pockets. <laughs> it doesn't have pockets, but I feel like it was a steal of a deal. So, happy I got this. And the last color puffer coat I need is white. And then I don't have to buy another puffer coat again. It may be green, but other than that, I need to stop buying puffer coats. <laughs> Next, we are going to get into bags. So, the first bag that I have here is just this white. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's just white. And it has, like, this um, quilting in the front and the back. And it also has this um chain here i don't think it has like a longer chain in the bag um but nevertheless i didn't like a new small white bag i feel like i'm tired and everybody else is tired of seeing my white telfer bag like i'm sick of it so i needed a new white bag um i really want um the jock moose bag um so hopefully i get that for christmas if not i'll just buy it um if not, I'll just buy it because I do want like a luxury like bag that has this similar shape and structure and that's also white because I do wear a lot of black and white so happy I got this. And then next I just have this um, puffer bag. Well, it was supposed to be a puffer bag but this thing is about flat. This thing is flatter than the earth like yeah i thought it was gonna be more puffy it's not so hopefully it translates well in pictures because it's just not giving puff right now at all just giving flat tote and i thought it was a little bit wider like based on the pictures on shein but maybe i should have just read the reviews but nevertheless it's still so cute like it's still a vibe I'm just hoping it looks good in pictures because right now it's giving paper. <laughs> paper thing. Moving on to headgear. I got this red beret because I saw this girl. I did not even put it on right, but I just got this red beret. Um, and I saw this girl um on Pinterest and I answered a picture. She was wearing this um red beret with a black jumpsuit, and I was like, oh, that would be perfect. So I was like, no, let me just get this so I could complete the fit and you know it'd be a vibe or whatever. So happy I got this. And then next, I just got some black earmuffs, only because, only because I'm really into earmuffs now. Like, I love hats, but I feel like they always mess up my hair, and then, you know, it just covers up my makeup, and then the earmuffs are just, like, literally all that I need, all that I need right now. It's making my ears warm, it's not messing up my hair, like, it's not taking away from anything. Really happy that I got this, so, so excited. I want all the colors, I want gray, I want cream, I want all of them. But yeah, I got these from Shein. I'm sure you can get them from like Amazon or whatever, but I think these are like $3, so. Last but not least, we move on to shoes. So I just have these red, 
boots, these red sock booties. These are a show stopper. Now, I did think that the um, front of the boot was pointy, but it's a little bit more of like a square, like rounded square kind of shape. Um, and they are like sock material, so it's not like leather or anything. And I got these to go with my, um, I got these to go with my red beret outfit, but I have no, I literally virtually have no red shoes like i have one pair of red heels and that's it and i feel like red is such a nice pop of color during the winter like i needed this red the red me and the red needed each other so i'm so glad i got these and i cannot wait cannot wait to style them like i cannot express i cannot stress this enough how much i cannot wait to style this the next boots I'm sure you've seen everywhere, but I decided to get them off of Shein because they have the most affordable pair, but it's just these black boots. The quality, I was shocked. The woman was too stunned to speak. Like, the quality of these boots are so, 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 so freaking good. And I have an idea, I have plenty of ideas that I could rock these boots, wear these boots, style these boots um so excited i see these all the time and i'm so glad she had them i do my next purchase is going to be these in like the white color so like the white and then this is the black part so that'll be my next purchase but these are so good like the quality is amazing so if you want to know like if the quality of these boots are good you heard it here first get them last but not least i do have these boots here they're just these long boots i do have black leather boots but the only black leather boots i have that are this height are heels so i needed one with a flat bottom unfortunately they um are not that tight around my they're not that tight around my thigh so they do like kind of sag a little but i feel like i can get away with it I feel like I can get away with it in pictures and it doesn't bother me too much to wear it. So I'm not too upset, but you guys will see what they look like in the try on portion. I'll style them for you guys. But nevertheless, these are mad cute. I needed a pair of these, so I'm not mad with this purchase at all. That concludes the end of this haul. Hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. I had a great time styling these outfits for you guys and show you guys how you guys can rock these Shein fits. Um, I forgot to mention that my Instagram was accidentally deleted, but... Hopefully we can get that resolved pretty soon. But in the meantime, make sure you follow me on TikTok because I'm posting on there every day. That is like my new thing. Like, so don't forget to follow me on TikTok and be on the lookout for when my Instagram comes back. And do not forget to like this video if you like this video. Comment down below. What was your favorite styling piece? What was your favorite piece? Like, what is something that you're going to run to Shein and get now? And if you made it this far, do not forget to subscribe to your girl. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.